Hi guys, printing hello world is the toughest thing in Java. Once you understood the hello world program, then everything is easy. If you know C++, then you are familiar with all the keywords and concepts used in hello world program. But if you don't know C++, then don't worry. You just need to watch these videos after watching this one. First, class and objects in Java and second, static keyword in Java. Don't worry. I'll try to explain everything in simple words so that everyone should understand the hello world program easily. So this is our hello world program. First, I will run this program on our IDE and then I'll teach you how to run this program using command line. But first, let's understand the code. We first created a class hello world. Inside our class, we have our main function that is public static void main. Don't worry about this public string and static keyword. Now this statement is important. System.out.println and then our message. System is a predefined class in Java. That is someone has written the code of system class and we are just simply using it here. Now what is out? Out is a static member in the system class. So static members can be accessed by its class name. So system is class dot is used to access and out is a static member. Don't worry if you are thinking that this stuff is difficult. It happens with everyone in the beginning. Now what is out? It's a standard output string. Okay, we mostly do two things. First, either we take input from user, for example from keyboard, or second is to display things on our monitor. Imagine the stream as cables between our code and these hardware devices. Input stream is like an input cable and output stream is like an output cable. Now I want to print hello world sentence on my monitor. So I have to use the output cable for this. And out is a standard output stream that is this out keyword does the work for us similarly if you want to take input then we have system.in system.out for outputting and system.in for input we'll see input later now println is just a method we call function as methods in java so we pass our message inside println in double quotes if you have at least understood 25% of this video, then congratulations. Just keep on watching and remember that hello world is the toughest thing in Java. Let's open our ID. Ok guys, go to file, then new, project, java is selected by default, then click on next, then click on java hello world, and next, and let's give project name as hello, so finish, ok this is our hello world program, Click on that green triangle and that's it. Hello world is printed. Hi guys, we just created this main class in our IntelliJ idea inside hello project. So cd is the command in windows to change the directory. So step 1 is to compile the program so we write java c and main.java that is the file name and then running file that is write java and the name of our file and now hello world is printed. The process is pretty simple first we compile then we run the program so java c and then file name.java. 
So we first compile the main program and main dot class bytecode is created and then we just run our program. So, so write Java and then file name and hello world is printed. That's it. This was easy. Guys, all my videos are free. We are not a team. I'm just a one man doing all this work. Please hit that like button. Visit Code Archery and subscribe. Don't forget to share. And thank you so much for watching my videos.